It's breaking news, a shooting outside of Staten Island High School. Students are sent running as parents rush to pick up. She just told me not to come to, to the school. She just told me to stay away, stay away, don't come. What happened just moments after dismissal? Good evening, I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. Tonight, one student is in the hospital after being shot outside that school. It happened just after students were let out of class for the day at Tottenville High School. CBS 2's Christina Fan live on the scene with the latest on the investigation. Christina. Well, Maurice and Christine, this shooting happened at the worst possible time as hundreds of kids were standing on this lawn outside waiting to be picked up. This was just after dismissal at around 1.50 this afternoon. Witnesses, these kids tell us they saw a group of men, about five of them, come out of a car, start firing, aiming towards this intersection, and one of those bullets hit a 14-year-old boy in the ankle. You can see him receiving medical treatment in this photo. Everyone else ran for cover, some down the sidewalk, others back into the school where everyone was told to shelter in place. Police say the 14-year-old was taken to Staten Island University North Hospital in stable condition. It's unclear if he was the intended target, but fellow students say he was a sweet kid and don't know why anybody would want to hurt him. Emotional parents who came to pick up their children and saw the crime scene say this was their worst nightmare. She texted me and she just told me that there was shots fired. There was three shots fired and she just told me not to come to, to the school. She just told me to stay away, stay away, don't come. So, but my instinct, I had to come. I couldn't leave. I'm texting her. She's not calling me back. So that's when I started getting worried. So where I usually park, I park in front, right in front of the school and she comes to my car, but this time it was different. So I got out just to see and then I saw a lot of families were crying behind me and mentioning that there's the crime scene right in front of me. And detectives say the investigation is still ongoing, but they believe this was an isolated incident. No one else at the school is in danger. They again are still searching for five suspects who were last seen running away in ski masks and gray sweatpants. We are live from the Tottenville section of Staten Island. Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. All right, Christina, thank you.